Shiny nose, nothing. No shiny nose. Be some blessings. I noticed you yes, walking sir. here. Um, walking by, we're here in Queensbridge Projects, mighty Queensbridge Projects, biggest housing projects in America, correct? That's correct. Mm -hmm. And right now it seems that we're in a state of emergency. Yes, sir. And particularly in the black community, but actually all over the world, there's emergencies going on. Right. But I couldn't help but notice this, this grand uniform you had on, and it brought to mind, I said, wow, now more than ever, mm -hmm. if we could have some form of military force that protects our own interests for a change instead of the interest of uh, foreign entities, corporate entities, yes, so on and so forth. Yes. Do you think that that would be a good idea for us to, you know, have a lawful militia or some kind of organization that would protect us from being otherwise abused? Yes, sir. Uh, this idea is not new. Marcus Garvey had the same uh, militia called the UNIA Black Legionnaires way back in the 1920s and a little bit before that. Uh, of course, you know what happened to him. He was arrested and charged with fraudulent charges, uh, put in a penitentiary, in Atlanta penitentiary, and then he uh, eventually deported to London. Uh, this country will not allow any type of black self-defense force to exist within this country, which is why they are killing us in record numbers at this time, in order to prevent that from happening. So, the symbol stands for the Pan-African Defense Force, I am one of the few who are still remaining from the old school days, and um, I am looking for new young people to become members of this because we're at break point. Okay, name and contact information, please. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Call me William Harvey, Commander, 914-703-7554, and I will be at your service immediately. Thank you. You're welcome. Appreciate your service to the community. Thank you, sir. Strength, survival, and blessings for you in the future. Thank you, sir. Hare Krishna.